Hey guys, what's up? Zap out at boy. And before I start the video, I just want to tell you guys something that everybody has been getting wrong. Like when they watch my videos, they think I'm a guy. Tell you the truth, I'm a girl. But uh, I just don't say anything because I don't really care what people say. And that's why my voice is really high pitched. For some of you, probably think I'm a guy and my voice hasn't been down to puberty. Well, I'm actually a girl, and that's why I say I'm a guy, because if I say I'm a girl, I'm scared you lose more views or something like that. I just don't know. I just never say it. But, uh, yeah, I'm a girl who plays Xbox, and uh, if you don't think girls belong on Xbox, um, nobody was asking you if you can leave a comment, then I'm just going to delete the comment. But, so, yeah. So, what I'm going to be doing is... I'm going to be reviewing an app today on the iPod, and, uh, yeah. So, I have a high-definition camera with me, so it's going to be better. Alright, so the game I'm going to be reviewing, I'm going to be doing like this so you can't kind of see my face. Because, so, here it is, the theme for Christmas. It's City, this is a jailbreak the iPod, I think. It's not mine. For some reason, it's Christmas, but it says slide for Mario. I really don't know. There we go. So the app I'm reviewing is called Falling Balls. Right here. And this game is basically about... Basically about... Um, you're this little man, like this guy, this man, and you're trying to dodge the balls that are coming at you. So, we're going to click about, and Falling Balls was created by Wicked Fist uh, Games and Bit 101. Both are owned and operated by K K Kent, I think, or I don't know how to read Peters, check them out at the website and the other website. So we're gonna go to main menu and we're gonna go to settings. Okay, so here are the settings. You have you can leave the sound on or sound off. I'm gonna leave it on for just reasons. Clear scores is if you have a high score and you want to clear it. Uh, I do not recommend doing that if you have a really high score, and I'm not gonna do that. The modes are ninja mode, advanced mode, and classic. So classic's the easiest, so I'm gonna start with that. She goes. You just tilt the screen, and I just failed. You just tilt the screen to move the man, or guy. So I kind of fail, but you get the gist. So it tells you score how many balls passed you over there, and three passed, which I failed, and my high score is 29. On my old iPod, it was a 60 something, so we're gonna go to main menu. I don't want to show you the reflection, but we're gonna go settings, and we're gonna change to advanced mode. Advanced, play game. So if you could tell, advanced mode, I didn't even move yet. Advanced mode, a lot more balls come. So, you can see how many balls come really fast. It's actually fun advanced mode. For classic mode, when you pass like 50, this is how fast the balls come at you. So, I got 12 balls past me in advanced mode, and my high score is 19. I just tried it right now. So, you, if next time I show you my score, it'll be a lot higher. So, I never tried ninja mode, so we're going to try that right now, and that's basically ninja we're going to play. Really don't. Oh, I think they go opposite. Oh, they go any way they want to, which is kind of creepy, because you don't know when it's coming and which way it's coming. So, my high score was 10 for this. So we can try that one more time. Ah! 
Okay, now I got nine. But that's like basically the gist of the game. All you do is you just move your iPod or iPhone left to right, tilting the screens to let your man move and the boss pass you. So um, that's it for this review of Falling Balls. Please comment, rate, subscribe. Sorry if you hear backgrounds. Oh my, someone's watching a movie. So I just moved this down a little. So thanks for watching. Hope you like the review of this guy. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and peace.